Damn near got mugged a couple of times. Once in a mall. Once on the street in Dallas. I didn't like it. I'm hoping for the next breath of air. That's it. That's it in a nutshell. Well, here we all are at Riddle of Steel. Okay. Who is the wisest and greatest of all masters? Don't you dare say me or some other asshole you know. It better be your own name. You just were assaulted, accosted, you defended yourself. Now you're trying to save that guy's life. Take care of him. It's part of your training. A bit of restraint in yourself and in what you do to another person is a very good thing. But it's all, at the end of the day, it'll save you a lot of trouble and possibly save your soul as well. The knife is very misunderstood. The knife can very often mean you don't have to use as much force. The story starts about a year ago. Uh, oh, found myself just rock bottom. Uh, I figured, what, what can I do? Where can I go? Met Jim, phenomenal man. His wisdom, everything that, that he just exudes, and, and not just in the arts, but in everything, in life, in death, spiritual. I always wanted to train under someone. I figured, why not now? Opened the magazine and here it is, a, you know, Comtech, Riddle of Steel, and I look through the pages and I see these huge people with black beards and, and you know, fatigues and big knives. Oh my God, these guys are mercenaries. They're, they got to be so, you know, they probably kill people all the time. I said, oh my God, it's, it looks interesting though. When all hell has come upon you, there's always one friend that has stood by me through thick and thin. This you can trust. I am not happy to have to justify my own self-defense. That's wrong.